Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Vid Local Food. Today we're going to share with you Kobia Fish Hot Pot, Lao Ga Bup. But before that, let's take a look at the peaceful corner of my hometown. Even though the specialty today is the gabba, the cobia fish, let me want to include shrimp and meatballs in the pot as well. Lemongrass is one of the herbs that can be used in all kinds of recipes, and is also popular most of Vietnamese hot pot. She crushes first on a cutting board, chops it into little pieces, and then run the knife over several times until it's minced. This Vietnamese coriander is also known as ngò gai, which you can find this in pho or other noodle soup. The broth will be more balanced and flavorful with a little sour taste. My mom prefers the kumquat juice, but you can also have a lemon one. It's up to you. Cobia fish was filleted by the vendor and my mom cuts it into bite-sized pieces and then washes. Here are the cobia fish, shrimp and meatball on a plate, spread sliced onions, chopped salami herb and fried shallot on a towel. Look at every fish flesh guys, it's so fresh. Frying shallots is usually the first step of the recipe, and it serves as one of the aromatic ingredients to build flavor just like garlic. And then add minced lemongrass and sauté them all together. Instead of water, my mom adds a coconut water to make the broth naturally sweet and clear. Coconut water is commonly used in southern regions where the coconut trees are plentiful. These edible white flowers are popular in Asian cuisine. They cause the Spaniard granny flower or vegetable hummingbird so pretty. The veggies we'll be eating today are those white flowers, water mimosa, along with the water spinach. When the broth is boiling, she adds everything on the plate into the pot, puts the lid on, and waits for it to boil again.
One is fully cooked. My mom gonna take half into another pot, put it on a small stove, which will set in the middle, and people will gather around the hot pot so they can help themselves or serve other family members. This dish is served with fish sauce, chilies added if you like spicy, immensely rice noodles, and here we are, our veggies today. You can help yourself to get what you like. Scoop the broth into the noodles. The soup is clear and tastes finely sweet. Dip a flesh of cobia fish into the pure fish sauce and take a bite to feel the slightly sweet flavor, the firm and dense texture. This hot pot would be more ideal if you enjoy it while it's raining and cold as it's gonna warm you up. And don't forget to dip our beautiful white flowers and olive veggie into the boiling broth. The flowers are crunchy and just a little bitter with this unique flavor. The water spinach and water mimosa are supposed to be enjoyed while they retain the green color. Please join us everyone, hope you like this video, thank you for watching, see ya!